Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Jeremy. Um, I have not been able to upload consistently on my channel because I have been busy and for the past week I have been sick and I'm still sick as you can hear from my voice and my eyes <laughs> still look sick but I am starting to feel better and that's why I am filming this video. So in this video we are going to review one of my favorite um, whitening products from the Philippines so I'm going to introduce them to you in a moment you guys have been asking me what are the best um, whitening soap whitening lotion um, whitening skincare products in the Philippines and this video is not sponsored um, they have not paid me to do this video but I think that I want to do this video because I have been using their products for quite a while now even if when I was still living in, in Cebu so without further much ado okay we are going to start and um, like I said, we are going to review Kevlo, okay? Kevlo, they don't have like emulsions or they don't have brightening serums, but I highly recommend that you apply your brightening serum um, in the daytime if you have. I talk about um, brightening serums, vitamin C a lot in my other videos. I like the Milano CC products. Uh, they are really good. They got um, the good vitamin C ingredients in there, active vitamin C ingredients. So you can apply those as well if you are doing your skincare routine in the morning. Okay, so now um, since it is uh, morning, okay, like I said, we do not apply our Kevlo clarifying lotion. We only apply this at night. And um, the ingredients of these are basically almost the same. They've got niacinamide, they've got arbutin, they've got green tea extract, they've got um, retinol palmitate. So if you decide to use this, make sure to use a very, very, very little amount at first and I recommend do not use this every night maybe if you're just starting out you can use this maybe three times a week okay like that and then once your skin gets used to it maybe every other day but I do not recommend you use this every day for the long term okay since it is daytime I'm going to apply the collagen the Kevlo collagen placenta this one and this one um, their new sunscreen is SPF 45 the older one was um, I think SPF 75 and it says here a sunscreen foundation so you can actually use this as a foundation as well that ensures your protection from the harmful effects of the UVA and UVB because we need to protect our skin from the UVA and UVB both all right so here ingredients we've got good ingredients here we've got coconut oil we've got glycerin um, we've got shea butter we've got titanium dioxide which is a good um, sunscreen ingredient and um, we also have retinol palmitate um, so far so good all right and I'll open it and this is how it looks this is how the color looks and um, by the way the yeah this is the balancing toner and this toner the color is a little bit pink so I don't know what kind of colorants they are using on these but it seems like most of their products uh, the color is a little pink but anyway like I said be careful just apply a little amount because if you apply a little bit like more than what you should be applying on your face you can feel that you can feel the sting you know like you can feel that your skin is reacting to it all right so let's just apply a little bit so maybe just like this okay and I'm going to put it here and then here and then a little bit in here as well and um, always when we apply something on our face it's we do it in a in an upward circular motion okay since these um, products are a little bit stronger so I would say less is more guys very important and I think I always say this do not forget to reapply your sunscreen every two to three hours especially if you are out and about and when the 
sunlight is very strong but even if I'm at home you know um, I always sit next to the window I apply my sunscreen I reapply my sunscreen I even apply sunscreen on winter when it is cloudy or when it is rainy day I apply my sunscreen like sunscreen is the thing that I take very very seriously and um, don't forget to apply some on your neck okay and at the back of your neck because our neck is very prone to skin aging because it is exposed to the sunlight and also our decollete like this part so make sure you apply there as well okay and um, I also recommend that you apply some sunscreen on your ears yes I do this actually I apply some sunscreen on my ears if I do not forget <laughs> so very very important all right uh, apply some sunscreen on the ears we also have to take care of our ears okay okay and that is your sunscreen and um, I also recommend you guys that after you apply all your Kevlo products, you also apply the repair cream. The repair cream is going to repair your um, skin barrier. Skin barrier is the this one, the surface of our skin. That's the skin barrier. And there are this repair cream, um, it will relieve itchiness and redness and dryness and crusting or any inflammation and discomfort from any various skin conditions. And this one you can apply morning and night as well. So let's take a look at the ingredients. So um, I think very good ingredients here. They've got collagen. Um, you know, collagen is really good. They've got citric acid. They've got glycerin to plump the skin. And this is how the repair cream looks like. So it's a little whitish cream. Just a little bit of cream, you guys, like this probably. And uh, here and here. And you probably don't even to apply this on all areas of your face, only those parts that you are worried that might have any itchiness or discomfort or inflammation. Okay, so maybe just like that cheeks and a little bit on the forehead and chin as well. Okay, and make sure that you do not apply any creams or any of these products close to your eyes okay and I'm also going to put uh, some on my neck because we applied some products here as well yeah so that's basically it that is your Kevlo starter pack or starter kit and um, yeah I think Kevlo products are good but if you are using them and if you are concerned make sure that you talk to your dermatologist or make sure that you talk to your esthetician or somebody who has um, knowledge about skincare and also ingredients alright guys that is it for this video I just wanted to show you how to apply these products and if you have used Kevlo products before please let me know in the comments down below and do you like them um, have you been to their skin clinic what are other um, whitening products that you have tried from the Philippines I know you guys like Koji Sun soap aside from Koji Sun aside from Kevlo what other products that you can recommend that you think that are good so um, thank you so much and if you have any questions please leave them down below um, please like and share this on your socials and also um, please comment and subscribe down below and I will see you guys next time and have a good day bye